So you've created your science fair project and you're ready to take it somewhere and to take it to a science fair. You have a lot of options. There are often school local science fairs that you can go to. I highly recommend that you go to a local fair first. There's also a lot of regions will have regional science fairs. You need to look on websites, check where your regional fairs are, and then you can go to the state fair. If a lot of times you could go, if there's no local or regional fairs, you can go straight to your state fair, but I highly recommend you get some practice first with a fair. If you do not have a local fair available, it's really easy to form one. Just take um, a few students that have done projects, bring them together, and get the parents to judge it. Judge each other's, ask questions, so it gives you that feel and that practice. But when you're ready to go to a regional or state fair, you will, what you can expect is to go um, and to sit and wait your turn for the judges to come. So it's often good to bring um, something to do during, while you're there, something to read or draw on, and get to know the other students that are, that are next to you. And then when it's your turn and the judges come, just, um, just let it shine. Talk about what you've learned and show them it. Show them that you're excited about your project. Excitement goes a long way in convincing the judges that this was a good project and that you learned a lot. So at the science fairs, um, you, need to, you should dress nicely. When the judges come up, you should stand up and look them in the eyes as much as possible. Point to your board, but try not to have your back to the judges. Smile at them, shake their hands. Um, did I say dress, you know, dress a little nicer? And make sure that all other objects that you brought with you to do while you're waiting for your turn are hidden and under the desk. Another thing that's really good is to move the chair out of the way so that the judges can get close enough to your board and to stand right next to you. So just some little tips for the judging. Just have fun. They're there to help you and to encourage you in science. So they're they're, they are there because they like science, and so they, you don't need to be scared about the judges. They're there for you. And um, just want to encourage you that um, you did your best, you worked hard, and there's a lot of competition. So uh, if you walk away with different, a, different, um, a different level of ribbon than you hoped to get, it's okay. You, the main thing that you got out of this was you learned about science, you learned how to give a speech, you learned how to analyze data, you learned how to do a lot of different things, create a display board, and it was a, um, a lot of things that you got out of it. So hopefully you'll be able to um, get some good ribbons at the fairs or trophies or awards, and, um, and that you'll learn from this exper experience and do even better next time.